Hello everyone, welcome to clickmyprojects.com. Well, it's coming for a very very interesting title, Cloud Computing. In this case, we are going to deal about privacy preserving in multi-keyword ranked search over encrypted cloud data. When, what's the most meant by cloud, generally? In general, cloud means just protect, protecting the data from the use other users through another, another kind of computer and advent cloud computing data owners are motivated to outsource their complex data management system from local sites and the commercial public clouds for great flexibility and economic service so in this case if we just filter it what are the things which we do in cloud computing what is upload and download uh, including nowadays it includes encryption and decryption upload download in our case what's our specific task is using ranked search on multiple keywords so that we can which it's easy to get download or upload the projects using multiple keywords so that in our paper for the first time we define and solve challenging problems of privacy preserving multiple keyword rank search our encrypted data is a cloud computing which is shortly known as MRSE we establish a set of strict privacy requirements for such a secure cloud data utilization and it's ma it's more possible to match out what's similar to the keywords and also we can get the data we can download the data from it in a decrypted in an encrypted form as well as we can decrypt it as possible uh, in this case for encryption and decryption we used AES algorithm so that we can get a get the secret key from the from the data user and we can store it in the database or whatever you wherever you want so that while decryption the key will be the suppressing key for the decryption data and we can download the files well let's get into our flow diagram this is the flow of the encrypted data cloud data <coughs> well this is login and uh, data owner and data user should get login in the same way and uh, only data owner can has the right and ability to upload the data and the data user can get permission from the data owner and can retrieve the data from the cloud server so that uh, you can understand that only three things are main in this flow diagram which is data owner data user and de encrypted cloud data uh, first of all let me go for the flow login data owner and data user has the same login form after the data owner is uploading the file uploading the file using the encryption with the encryption of the data and the data through to the cloud server after that uh, the cloud cl data user is searching and in searching for the data with an multiple use of keywords and uh, with the search of multiple using keyword he is just goes for the cloud server and he is just requesting the data from the data owner after that confirmation of the decryption of, uh, decryption file of the key so that he go for the search and retrieve data after that he downloads the data and gets the key from the data owner and he get back to the login form and he get decrypted data from the while this is the project which we intend to do it and here owner data user cloud and the registration form first of all we're going to run out the cloud let's compile it this is the data owner and the data user and the cloud and after that the registration form so we got four windows now whatever the thing is the first we need to register the form or else we can't go with it so that just giving for an example uh, Query and also give the owner IP 127.0.0.1, which is the user IP. And we'll say if it's a self host, so it's just giving for the local host. And after that, the username will be uh, AA, and the password also will be AA. So register it, 
after giving register just give it register form then now the registration has been done so now we are going to give the 100 process 1000 the port number port value will be 100 connected to the user so we have to connect with it so give the user RAM IP 127.0.0.1 and after that the port ID will be 100 which is equal to the equal to both of it and the username will be password also will be you know, now connected to it. now we got connected and now just login we got login inside with and both data user and data owner are connected now now we need to connect to the cloud IP now just giving for the cloud IP 127.0.0.1 and the cloud ID will be 123 and going for the cloud and just give the what same password 123 and give the login form now just login it now we got connected to the cloud also give ok and now we are going to generate some keywords so that we can use it in the for So now the data owner is going to upload for the forms. Now search a file. Of course, we got some file here. So that's produce a secret key and remove stopwatch for this one. And after that, extract some keys for it. And it's going to take a while because it's going to process for a lot of it. After that, encrypt a file. The file has been encrypted. Now we're going to send this for the cloud server. Send the keyword and the cloud will be getting the process the data will receive the keyword the file has been uploaded now send the whole file after that just receive the file and the file has been received by the uh, by the data owner now the cloud has received all the files now we can just produce to go with it for that example we just need to know that where the file has been gone the key in the data store all the files will be stored with the key after that now we are going to do what's not now we are going to search for a keyword the keyword will be networks or cloud now search it after that go for the cloud owner go for the data owner now we are going to create a trap for generation the cloud has been received the keyword which we gave and the trap drawer has been produced and these are all the words which are similar to the core to the given keyword now the cloud user the file has been received by the cloud user now the keyword now the cloud server is getting the trap door itself. these are all the similar words now just giving a search the file has been uploaded to the given search now we are going to see the similarities now we are going to say the similar these are all the queries which we gave and now we are going to find the similarity words well this cause a 9.99 for the similarity we can get the transparency as well as now we are going for the rank research we are just pushing up the button we got some 4 around full curves now we are just going to upload it so that the user can download it the user got downloaded the file file has been uploaded user got file has been received so that and after that the important thing is we get we just got the received data this is the file which is going to receive now we are going to decrypt the data so the file has been decrypted thank you